What's going on YouTube? Broken Place Great Ace here. Um, have kind of a quick video for you guys today. Just kind of wanted to get that out there. Um, on basically why I think that uh, prophecy and dragons are good. Because I've heard a lot of like stupid reasons why people think that they're good and like I've heard people say that uh, in dragons that they need to hit Draco Sack and Big Eye in September. And then I've heard people say that for prophecies that they need to hit Fate. Um, like granted those are good cards but I don't think they're the problem. Um, personally I think the only reason why dragons are as good as they are is because they have Super Rejuve. And the only reason Prophecy is good as they are now is because have Judgment. Because if they if you think back to Prophecy, before they had Judgment, it honestly was a deck that did nothing. Like, it wasn't even really a meta deck. It was just kind of just lingering there. Um, but as soon as they got Judgment, like, it just became, like, Tier 1. Because it's just that one stupid card that gains them so much advantage. It's just, like, an easy plus 3, plus 4, plus 5. Um... So, if they hit Prophecies, which, I mean, I think they are, but I don't th think they're going to hit Judgment just because it was, like, just released. Um, but if they really wanted to hit the deck to the point where it wasn't, well, it, w it would still be playable, but it would be fair, they'd have to hit Judgment. Or actually, they'd have to ban Judgment. Because if they hit Judgment to 1, they can still search it very easily, and then they can, like, remove it with Fate. And then get it back with Eternity and then just use it again. So the only way to make Prophecy a fair deck is to at some point ban Judgment. Because um, again, like Fate, good card, Secrets, or I guess it could hit Secrets too. Um, not trying to make this like a balanced predict uh, prediction video or anything. I'm just saying uh, that the only reason why Prophecy is good is because of Judgment. And the only reason Dragons are good is because of Super Ejuve. Because if they didn't have that card, the way that the deck plays out in about three turns, they'd be top decking. Because that's like their draw card. Because they, they run out of a hand super easy. And granted, they can pretty much use their uh, grave as a hand too. But within like three turns, they're going to run out of dragons. And if they didn't have super eju, they had like no way to just like regain advantage. So I feel that... If they hit dragons, or the way to stop dragons is to ban Super Ejuve. Um, I can actually see that happening, because it's kind of an old card, and it's just stupid. Like, it just gains way too much advantage. Um, again, not trying to make this a balanced prediction video or anything. Just kind of getting it out there why uh, dragons and prophecy are as good as they are. Just because I've heard a lot of stupid reasons why uh, people uh, think that they're good, and they're just wrong. Um, but yeah, hopefully you like the video, hopefully you agree with me, if you don't, um, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but yeah, uh, thanks for watching, um, I'll have another video up probably tomorrow, don't know what it, it's gonna be yet, probably, it's, it's probably gonna be a dual video. Um, but yeah, uh, thanks for watching, and until next time, keep it real.